Okay, so I just want to show uh, how to install the script and link to the Lucasena GUI. So you just grab it from the GitHub and code and then download a zip. Yes. Whoops. And then you just install it. Um, So here you have, uh, actually it's also, you can just delete version 1, it should also be, it's only version 2 that you'll be needed, um, you'll be needing. Now we also have to install the, uh, the Lucas in a GUI, because that's the requirement. So it's also available on uh, GitHub, just do the same. No, this is the this is this library folder that has the scripts. Uh, so you have the core and then the classes. So we need to link to those um, for it to work. So let me just open. Uh, let's take. Studio code, yeah. So it's already this is a it's not the right one. Open file. Mm -hmm. So in the media tip, tempo mapper that you downloaded, uh, main open media tempo mapper version zero two, and this is where you have to uh, create. The correct link. So the way that the easiest way to do that is just where you install the Casino GUI um, to find library, uh, and then for the core, you can just press. If you press up here in Windows, then you get the path, and it's just copy it. go so it's so and then you'll have to set it up here um, and then change all the backward slashes to forward slashes and then you would have to do the same with all of the uh, with all of them So the first uh, library core is just outside of the classes. Uh, it's not in the classes folder. The other one will be in the classes folder. So we can do it like that. Uh, oh, I think it's a clever way to. Oh, I don't know how to do it. All right, I found what I was looking for. So it's the. In Visual Studio Code, in Visual Studio, you can use a multi-edit, holding Control Alt and then press down. So, that will be a bit faster. Oh, so it, I have to do it again. Okay, maybe that's a faster way. Uh, let's just do. Let's I'll just, you can also just copy paste the top like that. And all of 
problem. Like that. Okay. So now the the GUI will be set up. Um, oh yeah, In the extra classes. Uh, for some reason, we have to do this with a with a uh, the reference like that. So um, let's just find the file. Uh, yeah, script. So this is just the main folder we have to link to for where you have the, the other helping scripts. Then we do the same, just link. Right. So that's the way to do it. Um, and now that we have to install the, the script in Reaper, so I'll go into Reaper and show the action list. And this is actually, uh, you can do it in the main or in the MIDI editor where you want the script to show up just install in the main um, new action load real script and then you have to link to it uh, let's see you installed it Reaver scripts media tempo mapper and there you go and now it's installed um, in the main section, so when you're in the main editor, and we can make a shortcut for it if needed. Control T is what I like to use. Control Alt T will then trigger it. So let's see if it works. Control T, and this is it. Now it's ready to work. All right.